All right, now welcome to SE Custom Designs and a Saturday morning edition to a cup of coffee in the witch shop, except we're on the porch. Um, it's hard not to be on the porch this time of year when you look at the beauty of what God has given us. But we're going to get to the projects that we're working on. Let's just have a look at the garden. Isn't it beautiful? What I can't share with you is how fragrant these lilacs are. They're so fragrant. So beautiful. Spring is really, really um, upon us. Look what we got going over here. Strawberries already. Before you know it, they'll be here. So we've got all kinds of things going on in the garden. All kinds. Just enjoy that. Now, let's come back to... Oh, we gave this guy here a coat. He's called Junior, apparently. I wouldn't want to mess with Junior. And we have this guy here. All right. So what have we been doing in the wood shop lately? Oh, by the way, a little bit of hint before we get into that. This is a really cool coffee mug. It's got wood shop tools displayed here like this. And uh, how do you know when it's time to go back to work? Well, when when this happens. Here we go. Love that concept. Yep, time to go back to work. But not just yet. All right, there's my real cup of coffee over here. All right, so what have we been working on? Um, this here, if you've been watching me for any length of time, is because of designs, it's called the Hobbit Hill. Got two sides to it. One's a little rougher than the other. Yep, calling this the Hobbit Hill. And uh, each drawer was cut out of the stock. So this is a push-through drawer concept. As opposed to this guy over here, I'm not sure what we're gonna call him, but these uh, these uh, drawers go in and out uh, only in the front, okay. So yeah, this is the Hobbit Hill. So he's mostly finished. We uh, just have to put some kind of um, uh, finish like uh, poly or some kind of oil on it. Really not sure exactly what we'll do there. So that's that. That's the Hobbit Hill. Let's put them down here. And yep, they come out of uh, logs and, and throw away uh, stock. We've got two maple logs. We're going to have probably around 10 of them. Thank you. Um, you know who you are, who is who's uh, bringing those up from down south in New York. So this here, I'm hoping to attract an ophthalmologist, somebody who works on. And he's still very wet, by the way. But um, look how big that is. You could probably sell that by itself. It's very, very interesting. Um, and then he fits in here. So this is cut out of one again one solid piece of uh, stock okay push him over there he's quite heavy this here guy is very interesting I love the again the unique shape that we got going on with the with this one um, this is also is a the drawers can go either way but we have a big surprise for you on the other side if you've already seen it it's no surprise if it's your first time looking check that out <laughs> You would not know that was back there, hey? So I was very careful to try to cut the um, the drawer out so that um, you could make a drawer out of it. So there's the there's the drawer it's like this. Isn't that beautiful? So yeah, that was that was a lot of fun to. To make sorry about the twisting guys and there you go 
I mistakenly burnt in my, I got to sand that out, uh, handcrafted by SC Custom Designs, it's supposed to go in the bottom. I must have been pretty tired. <laughs> so that's that one. You can see it was cut out of rough stock. And the last one we're working on is putting down here. You need an idea how big they are. There's my foot. Um, here's my foot over here. This guy is huge. All right. Now, he was also cut out of uh, what would have been thrown into the garbage or get, got burned or the dumpster or whatever. This is a solid piece of oak. Look at how handsome this is. Solid piece of oak, my friends. And originally it was cut out of stock that was rectangular, like this. And I just sort of went to town on it. And uh, these drawers were, specifically this one was quite uh, handy. It's hard to cut out. I held on to this with vice grips in, when I was cutting it on the bandsaw. What you're going to put in there, hey, that's between you and your drawer. So these are all going to go. I, I'm not going to be able to get that out with one hand. These are all going to be sold. Regrettably. Why do I say that? Sold regrettably in the uh, our craft show. Because, you know, you put a lot of time and effort into making these treasures. And... Uh, You know, it's, you don't want to part with them. My my price is going to be uh, up there because you know we deserve to get what we what we put into these projects. You know, all the effort. <laughs> so there you go. That's what we've been working on. Huh, let us know uh, what you'd like to see cut out of a piece of log or stock. Uh, each and every one of these was, uh, at first I had no clue, no idea what was going to come out of it. And then I just took my time with it. Um, they start talking to you after a while and say, you know, this is what I need to look like. And so there you go. Thanks for coming to the shop. AC Custom Designs. That being said, on to my front porch. Take care. Have a happy and productive Saturday. And, uh. Subscribe if you like what you see it. Again, let us know. We'd love to hear your comments. And um, we'll get back to you. Give us a thumbs up. Comment down there. And uh, we'll just keep the projects coming. Take care.